Hi guys, it's Deidre from Our Upcycled Life and welcome to my workshop and welcome to my channel. Uh, today I have a tutorial on four different painting techniques um, to take a brand new piece of pine and make it look old and rustic and chippy um, before you make a sign on it. So I'm going to show you those four techniques and you can pick out which one you like the best and try to create it yourself at home. Um, if you like thrifting, DIYs and repurposing, you've come to the right place and we'd love to have you follow along. So make sure you like, subscribe and hit the bell for notifications so you don't miss any great content. And I'm also going to put a link below for my Facebook and my Instagram because I do lots of daily activity over there that I don't make videos on um, that you would probably really like to see that I've uh, all the stuff that I've created over there. Okay. Let's get started.
Vaseline. Um, I just use my finger and anywhere where the wood would wear off um, or any of the corners, any of the edges, I just liberally put Vaseline all along the edge of the whole board. Now once again you're going to take your homemade chalk paint and just liberally coat it from one end to the other um, and don't use too many brush strokes because you want to keep the Vaseline kind of in the same spot as where you put it so you might have to pat it a little bit um, and put the chalk paint on quite thick and then just let it dry. And this is a fun technique, it uses pickling salt. Um, and I'm just going to paint the pine with a good thick coat of the homemade chalk paint. I'll put a link to the homemade chalk paint in below in the description. It's a really good recipe and it works really well. Um, and uh, you can find it down there. Now you're just gonna take a handful of the pickling salt and just sprinkle it all over the wet paint, all over the board, everywhere from end to end. And not too, too thick, but just kind of spread it out evenly over the whole board, sprinkle it. Um, I think I might need a little bit more. And you can use any type of salt. You don't have to use a pickling salt. The finer grain that you use, the more finer grain you're going to have of a texture. This is gonna leave more of a, a real thick texture. And the last technique is just to use a scraper. So you're going to put a thick coat of the homemade chalk paint all over the pine from end to end. And then you're just going to take your scraper and you're just going to scrape off all that wet paint that you just painted on and it leaves a really neat kind of um, grainy look to the wood.
I love all these painting techniques and they each have their own unique look. I made four of the exact same signs so you can see the difference between each painting technique and how it makes the sign look so much different. I'd love to know what's your favorite technique. Was it the Vaseline? Was it the, st uh, the stain? Was it the scraper? Or was it the salt? I actually really like the salt. I think it gives it a really neat texture and a really old kind of chippy look. Let me know. I hope you enjoyed today's video and I've been able to teach you uh, maybe a different painting technique that you haven't tried out yet. And if you have enjoyed this, I'd love for you to give a thumbs up and like and subscribe and have a great day.